What's up guys, so Jake Paul and Tyrone Woodley finished another press conference today and a couple of new headlines have come out of this. One of them being Jake Paul responding to a question asked by an interviewer about Dana White. So basically the interviewer asked him, would you invite Dana White to this upcoming fight? Jake Paul responded basically saying no, Dana probably wouldn't come and that the back and forth between them has been going on for a while. And he feels like Dana White's always just trying to discredit him. And he gave the example how before this fight was booked, Dana would always be calling Tyron one of the best welterweights ever. And after this fight was booked, Dana's always talking about Tyron like he's washed, he's past his time. So then the reporter goes on to ask him how he thinks this feud between him and Dana is going to end. Jake Paul said that he thinks he's going to meet Dana in a club and probably knock him out one day. And then he went on to say that he's not only gunning for these big fights with Conor and Floyd, now he has his eyes on the championship. He wants to fight people like Canelo. So classic Jake Paul, he's making a lot of headlines, talking a lot of crap about everybody he can. But I feel like it might backfire on him this time. Tyron Woodley got pretty heated at the end of the press conference when he saw some of Jake Paul's team going back and forth with his mother. He got pretty heated. Him and the team got into it with each other. His sister started going off on Jake Paul's team. And yeah, you could tell Tyron was really pissed in those interviews afterwards. Maybe Jake Paul's lighting a fire underneath him. He shouldn't have. He's just adding to the fuel. Obviously, his team's full of a bunch of goons and you couldn't expect anything more from them. But you know, you don't really go at anybody's mother, especially Woodley's mother, who's just so loved by the MMA community. Now, I'm sure everybody watching this is pulling for Woodley, but let me know down below if you guys have any doubts. Are you worried Jake's going to pull this through and surprise us like he did before? Let me know down below. If you guys want quick sports updates like this, make sure to like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys in the next one.